question is, do I support the fair tax? Uh, why or why not? Uh, as far as its entirety in its current state, uh, I do not. There are pros to the fair tax that I do like, that I find are positive. I like the fact that there is a tax that all people, whether they're here legally, illegally, whether they are involved in, in, in business or not, that they pay a tax uh, based on what they purchase. I like that theory and I like that very, very much. I also like the fact that for those in different economic uh, positions in life, that there's a prebate, that that prebate takes into consideration the economic state of everyone uh, based upon their income. I like that very much. But there are some things that bother me very, very greatly about the fair tax. First and foremost, you vote in the fair tax, it does not automatically repeal the 16th Amendment. And yet, that is how this is being given to the American people, that you vote for it and it will automatically uh, end the 16th Amendment. And that is just not true. It, 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 is, it says that the 16th Amendment should be repealed, but it doesn't repeal it. And so therefore, the last thing I want is the current tax system uh, that we have with IRS and then, the current, uh, and then also uh, have the fair tax. The implementation of this plan, I think, is flawed. Secondly, as a small business owner who creates jobs and sweats a payroll every Friday, I, I'm tired that they don't give me enough consideration for hiring the person that collects that tax. Oh, they give me a menial .075 for that person, but that person cost me a whole heck of a lot more than .075 of the money that we send to them. I'm tired of small business doing all the heavy lifting for the federal government. And so therefore, I don't like that either. Also, I think the 23% that they have proposed can rise too fast. And if we're not in trouble, that 23% will be 48% overnight.